How's it going everybody? Welcome back to Mojo Grip Mike here. So if you've ever wanted to fly but don't have time to get your license or perhaps you can pass your medical, well, I've got an option for you. Stay tuned, we're gonna check out the Merlin Light. Ladies and gentlemen, a true ultralight aircraft I have here, Merlin Light. If you recall, if you're new to the channel, welcome. But if you are old to watching the channel, last, no, no, two years ago, we checked out that. That's the Merlin, both one-seater, but that's a more powerful plane. And this year, they're coming out with something even better. And this is for all of the folks who wants to get in the air, but, Perhaps you can pass your medical or you can get your pilot's license. Because guess what? With ultralight, you only need a driver's license to fly. But always encouraged to get your training done. And guys, I'm going to go through the specs of this airplane. But I'm going to give you a nice 360 view. As you can see, it is an airplane. It flies. But... The numbers are just mind blowing and just the size of this then this probably is the lightest plane that I've ever seen, okay? So full gross, only 550 pounds. And as I mentioned, you've only got one seat and this thing is so nice and low to the ground that you can easily just tuck your butt in, get in your seat and go flying. And this is it, this is all of it <laughs> right here. Very simple, constructed. You see your cockpit here, you don't have much. You've got your airspeed, you've got your fuel gauge, and you've got one or two electronic switches. One cool feature you will get with this aircraft, look at that. You've also got a parachute on board, and you've got a single center stick here for full control. And up here is where you have your flaps. I don't imagine you can carry a lot of things back here, and I wouldn't, but you can't take this plane on, I would say, a short cross-country flight. With this tiny engine, guys, this plane will fly up to four hours. Okay, you want to know how much fuel you're burning? Wait for it. One gallon per hour. That's, <laughs> that's how fuel efficient this thing is. Now, it is a very, very small engine. As you can see, there's not much to it. Only 38 horsepower, but you will take off and you will cruise. Takeoff is about 500, 600 feet per minute that you're climbing. And in cruise, you're going about 75 miles per hour. Not bad. Now, here's the catch. With ultralight, you cannot have more than five gallons of fuel. So total amount of fuel in this airplane, about four gallons. And again, because you're only burning one gallon of fuel per hour, you've got enough to take you from point A to point B. But I imagine that whoever's flying this thing really is just wanting to get in the air. You're not, you're not flying for an extended mission or anything like that. You just wanna go up, feel, you know, feel the skies, and come back down. Now in this configuration, you can see this aircraft is a tail dragger, but standard comes with a tricycle landing gear. So this is just for show. And one thing you will see in this particular one, you've got this additional motor here on that wing. And then also on this wing. Now, this feature is currently not available. It's still in research phases, they've told me. And the reason why you have those, those are actually electric motors. And they're supposed to work together with your gas motor to give you additional power during liftoff and climb. So I think that would be really beautiful if they can make it work. Perhaps you don't even need the extra power to fly this thing. You've already got a tiny engine and if you've got an hour, two hours, just wanna burn some time flying, this is it right here, okay? Now, let me tell you how much you're paying for this bad boy, okay? I've said that the engine is only 38 horsepower. You've got 550 total gross weight so you're very light and you also have the option for the parachute 
and your payload, meaning the most you can weigh sitting in this plane is 300 pounds, which I think is plenty. Now, here comes the price. For all of this, you're only paying $36,000. Fully finished airplane. Not a kit, not something you have to wait for to be built. The airplane is fully finished, built at $36,000. And of course, you probably have your freight costs to get it shipped to you. But for everything you're getting, only 36 grand, to me, that's just what makes this attractive. And like I said, is for people who wants to fly and perhaps can get through medical or whatever the case may be but here guys is the merlin light i hope you've enjoyed this is really not much to the airplane there's not much to cover uh, but i hope you enjoy this one if you did please give the video a thumbs up also if this is your first time be sure to subscribe with the notification bell on again my name is mike thanks so much for watching guys a great way to support the channel become a premier member or go on to mojogrip.net forward slash mvp and sign up there and I will catch you on the next video.